So this self-defense is grab the hair from the front and we'll also do grab the hair from the rear. This is always a really tricky one to me. And uh, this is one I, I worry about getting it right a lot. And again is uh, the immaculate Jacob helping us today. So grab the hair from the front and we'll do some variations on this also. So he's gonna grab his right hand, uh, mostly for two reasons. One, most people are right handed. But I encourage you to train both ways just in case, right? Um, also, the right hand, you can see him on the camera a little bit better. So first thing you want to do is protect your hair. If I stand here like this and he pulls, there's a good chance he could pull me forward, but also he could just pull out a handful of hair and in real life, it's not just hair. Their you know, skin gets attached to that a lot of times. So hand goes over here and here, and I'm going to clamp down. Now, this will give you a little bit of protection if he starts to punch that arm because really nobody's just going to grab and just stand there and look at you, right? They're going to start hitting with that arm. So that protection helps a little, but it's not going to help a lot. So you're going to try to move as quick as you can, right? So here, here. Now, from this, I'm going to step back with my right leg. It could be left, but for this, I'm going to do right leg. And I keep this gripping real tight on his wrist. And I'm going to push forward with my head. So if he lets go for a second, you'll see basically what's happening is my head is pushing here on the top of his, his knuckles or his fingers while my hands are pulling this way. So it's basically making his hand do this, right? So. I'm here and I push down, and I can even push forward towards him. And I've got, and I keep my, my fingers there, and I push my thumbs up against his knuckles as I make that transition. All right? So it's here, it's here. Protect my head, go down, push. As he pulls off, I push my finger, or my thumbs against his fingers. Now, could he still hit with other arm? Yes, he could. You gotta be careful for that, and really watch. And when you see that start to go, crank the arm down. At least get him at a bad angle where he can't hit as well. Now, from there, you can do lots of things. You can turn and run if you want to be really mean. Slam into him, then run. You can kick. Lots of things, okay? So, again, he grabs. Grab, grab. The ridge, that edge of your hand, goes in on the bend of his wrist. Thumbs go here. Push. Pull down. Kick. Turn. Run away. Anything else you want to add in there? That's it. That's pretty simple. Let's grab the hair from the front. 